We've been spotted. Oh shit. Oh, someone used lift. Who has lift? Oh, was, was it warp? Oh, it was levitate. Good call. Good call. That one's easy. Easiest puzzle ever. Nice. 2K, you gonna buy me some sweet shit. But from what I remember, 2K wasn't a lot if the currency system's the same as before. What do we got here? I don't have over. down. Oh shit. Oh god. We got this. We got this. That's how I check my objective. Awesome. Move faster. Oh, drone. Oh god, it's a rocket. Screw that. How fast do those recharge? Not, not fast, fast enough. Oh goodness. Me. You're done! One less! Yeah! Shepard, we are inside the loading docks. Vitor reprogrammed the heavy mech. It's tearing Praza's squad apart. They did want to get to Vitor first. Get your squad into cover and I'll open the loading bay doors. Shepard, you take point. Uh oh. Okay. Go here. Point, Shepard. We'll cover the door. You go there. Okay. I'm up front. Let's do this. Oh, there. My bad. Right. And I'm here. Bring it on. Ah, <laughs> shit. You guys are useless. Yeah. Oh. That max got heavy armor plating. Those quarians never stood a chance. This is gonna be one tough son of a bitch to take down. Ideas. Overload, take out that shield. All right, I'm down. <clears throat> oh God. Come this way. Reload, reload, reload. Oh, she's dead? What the hell, man? Oh, wrong one. Why didn't that... Back yet? Come on. Unity. Hurry up. Back up. 
wonder. Let's see what happens here. Blow up in this guy's face. He goes. No. Whatever. But you guys attack. Down. It's going up. All right, she died. Nice. I mean, she didn't die. <laughs> that was a really weird battle. Now what's Radio? this? Monsters coming back. Mechs will protect. Safe from swarms. Have to hide. No monsters. No swarms. No, 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 no. Vitor? No Vitor. Not here. Swarms can't find. Monsters coming. Have to hide. Nobody's gonna hurt you anymore. I don't think he can hear you, Commander. Have to hide. Have to hide. Max. <laughs> Human, where did you hide? How come they didn't find you? Who didn't find us? The, the monsters, the swarms, they took everyone. Why didn't the colonists fight back, Vitor? What happened? You don't know. You didn't see, but I see everything. Looks like security footage. He must have pieced it together manually. What the hell is that? My god. I think it's a collector. Is that some kind of alien? There are species from somewhere beyond the Omega-4 relay. Only a few people have ever seen one in person. They usually work through intermediaries, like slavers or hired mercenaries. If they're involved with the Reapers somehow, it could explain what happened to the colonies. The collectors have advanced technology. They could have a weapon that disables an entire settlement at once. The Seeker swarms. No one can hide. The Seekers find you, freeze you, then the monsters take you away. Tell me more about these swarms. It's how they find you. Seeker clouds, machines like tiny insects. They go everywhere. They find you, then they sting you, freeze you. Sounds like miniature probes, maybe. Find victims, then immobilize them with a stasis field or nerve toxin. What happened next? The monsters took the people onto the ship, and then they left. The ship flew away. But they'll be back for me. No one escapes. I think that's probably all we're getting out of them, Commander. I remember the day when I had a ship. We appreciate what you told us. You were very helpful. I studied them. The monsters. The swarms. I recorded them with my Omni tool. Lots of readings. Electromagnetic. Dark energy. We need to get this data to the elusive man. Grab the quarry and call the shuttle to come pick us up. What? Vitor is injured. He needs treatment, not an interrogation. We won't hurt him. We just need to see if he knows anything else. He'll be returned unharmed. Your people tried to betray us once already. If we give him to you, we'll never get the intel we need. Fraza was an idiot, and he and his men paid for it. You're welcome to take Vitor's Omnitool data, but please, just let me take him. You don't have to take Vitor and go. We could work together, just like old times. I want to, but I can't. I've got a mission of my own. It's too important for me to abandon, even for you. When it's over, and I'm still alive, We'll see what happens. Vitor goes with Tally. He's traumatized and he needs medical care. Tally will give us the Omnitool data and take him to the flotilla. Understood, Commander. Thank you, Shepard. I'm glad you're still the one giving the orders. Good luck out there. If I find anything that can help you, I'll let you know. We're ready for pickup. I want to pick up the rest of my crew. 
I don't like these new guys. Shepard, good work on Freedom's progress. The Quarians forwarded their findings from Vidor's debriefing. No new data, but it's a surprising olive branch given our history. You and I have different methods, but I can't argue with your results. You ever think about playing nice once in a while? Diplomacy is great when it works, but difficult when everyone already perceives you as a threat. But more importantly, you confirm the Collectors are behind the abductions. Why do I get the feeling you knew about them already? I had my suspicions, but I needed proof. The Collectors are enigmatic at best. They periodically travel to the Terminus systems, looking to gather seemingly unimportant items or specimens, usually in exchange for their technology. When their transactions are complete, they disappear as quickly as they arrived, back beyond the unmapped Omega-4 relay. Until now, we've had no evidence of direct aggression by the Collectors. Why is the Omega-4 relay unmapped? What do we know about it? Only that no ship passing through it has ever returned. Our best guess is that the relay reacts differently to Collector vessels, allowing them safe passage. If they can manipulate relays, that's just further evidence of the connection with the Reapers. Kind of like the Bermuda Triangle. Any ideas on why they shifted their focus to humans? If they're agents for the Reapers, it could be any number of reasons. Obviously, humanity played a huge role in Sovereign's destruction. That might have been enough to draw their attention. What really concerns me is why they bother abducting the colonists. Once the humans are paralyzed, why not just kill them? This guy has serious sharing in eyes. What are the collectors getting from these deals? The Collectors aren't very forthcoming about their motives. Generally, they seek out species with rare genetic mutations or abnormalities. They pay slavers and work groups exorbitant sums to obtain these specimens, and then they leave. But they've never targeted a single species before, and the previous sample sizes were in the dozens, not the tens of thousands. You're holding something back. How do you know the Reapers are involved? The patterns are there, buried in the data. The Consul and the Alliance want to believe the Reaper threat died with Sovereign. You and I know better. I won't wait until the Reapers are on the march. We need to take the fight to them. Once again, this game still has excellent, excellent voice acting, which is to be expected, because the last one, had, last one had awesome voice acting as well. If this is a war, I'll need an army. Or a really good team. I've already compiled a list of soldiers, scientists, and mercenaries. You'll get dossiers on the best of them. Finding them and convincing them to work with you could be challenging, but you're a natural leader. I'll continue to track the Collectors. When they make their next appearance, I'll notify you and your team. Be ready. <laughs> I don't think so. Keep your list. I want people I trust. The ones who helped me stop Saren and the Geth. That was two years ago, Commander. Most of them have moved on, or their allegiances have changed. Garrus. Where's Garrus Vakari? The Turian disappeared a few months after you were declared dead. Even we haven't been able to locate him. Where's Ashley Williams? She's still with the Alliance. Promoted, I believe. Her file is surprisingly well classified. Where's Erdnot Rex? He returned to Chichanka, and he hasn't gone off-world in over a year. He's trying to unite the Krogan clans. What about Tally? She already helped us on Freedom's Progress. That was unexpected. I need more intel before I'll commit to that. Where's Liara Tassoni? She's on Ilium. My sources say that she's working for the Shadow Broker. If so, she can't be trusted. Okay, I get it. They're not available. You're a leader, Shepard. You'll get who you need. I'm a Spectre, bitch! I'm still a Spectre. Maybe I can get the Council to help us out. If you think you can convince them, by all means. Just remember, you've been gone a long time. Things have changed. You worry about the collectors. I'll make sure my team's ready. Good. Two things before you go. First, head to Omega and find Morden Solis. He's a brilliant Solarian scientist. Our intelligence suggests he may know how to counteract the collectors' paralyzing seeker swarms. I haven't even started and you're telling me what to do? I'm giving you directions. What you do with it is up to you. I'm sure you'll make the right decision. All right. What's the other thing? I found a pilot I think you might like. I hear he's one of the best. Someone you can trust. Check 
Joker. Make matter. Just like old times, huh? He's walking. I can't believe it's you, Joker. Look who's talking. I saw you get spaced. Got lucky, with a lot of strings attached. How'd you get here? It all fell apart without you, Commander. Everything you stirred up, the Council just wanted it gone. The team was broken up, record sealed, and I was grounded. The Alliance took away the one thing that mattered to me. Hell yeah, I joined Cerberus. You really trust the elusive man? Well, I don't trust anyone who makes more than I do. But they aren't all bad. Saved your life. Let me fly. And there's this. They only told me last night. Nerdgasm. Fa 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 fa. It's so shiny and sexy. Ooh, I likes. I likes. It's good to be home, huh, Commander? I guess we'll have to give her a name. Normandy 2. So I, get, I guess I get a report after every single mission. And then we now we have these for loading screens instead of elevators. <laughs> Exact same layout. Welcome aboard the new Normandy, Commander. I think I just I've saw Shepard pop a boner. I'd strongly recommend starting by acquiring Morden Solus, the Solarian professor on Omega. We know the collectors use some type of advanced technology to immobilize their victims. We'll need him to develop a countermeasure to protect us. Without that countermeasure, we'll be helpless if we ever run into the Collectors. Acquiring Professor Solus seems like the most logical place to start. Who are you? I am the Normandy's artificial intelligence. The crew like to refer to me as Edie. Helmsmen aren't happy when someone takes control of a ship away from them. Especially Joker. I do not helm the ship. Mr. Moreau's talents will not go to waste. During combat, I operate the electronic warfare and cyber warfare suites. Beyond that, I cannot interface with the ship's systems. I observe and offer analysis and advice. Nothing more. I'm guessing it takes more than just the three of us plus Joker to fly this ship. The Normandy has a full crew. They're at their stations awaiting your orders. Final preparations for takeoff are complete, Commander. When you're ready to go, just pick a destination from the galaxy map and the CIC and I'll plot a course. Jacob and I should return to our posts. Come find us if you have any questions. Alright. Private terminal. Ooh, armory.
Come on. I know the ship like the back of my hand. Gotta get the professor. Okay. Welcome aboard, Commander. But, anyways, guys, that'll be it for this episode. So, hopefully, you guys enjoyed. And as always, if you enjoyed, please give the video a quick rating. And I will see you guys next time for some more Mass Effect 2. Alright, have a fantastic day.